Hello and welcome back to The Walking Dead Saints and Sinners. Hopefully this time... Oh, I dropped my knife. Hopefully this time I can get through without blowing myself up near the library. I thought I was holding my knife. No, but I'm doing it anyway. You on the prowl? I see you looking with them rabbit dog eyes. Well, I ain't gonna buy it. Not in my nature. The deal. Where are you at, tourist? That's where Gotta talk at. ASAP. You looking to deal? Beep us. I'm always looking to deal. And I think you're the person I'm looking for. Oh, yeah? Well, that don't surprise me. Everyone's heard the name Whistles. What do you need? I was told you're the per- Ooh, yeah. Whoever you've been talking- Are we talking people? What you looking to a- A person? Am ah, yes. I can't get to- These trigger happy- My go-to for the- Library. Yep. Hard. Anyway. Explosion store? Do me a favor, you Cut through the reclaimed. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Seems alright to me. And before they keep messaging me, let's just... There you go. Your 
you mind? You out scavenging tourist? Yeah. I waste you fuckers all day. <laughs> 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 There you go. Thanks for the uh, request. I'll fill it when I remember to. Yeah, I think that was upstairs. Go back. I lost my shotgun. Don't hang around too long. Oh, there's my shotgun. I didn't lose it. I just put it in the wrong slot. Brilliant. So I just wasted some time and risked more zombies spawning. Okay, it's good to know that those nail bombs explode on impact. So they are very different from the uh, grenades. It also means I have to throw them further.
tough road going it alone. Idea. That can come in useful. Lighting glitch. Hey, you on the prowl? I see you looking with them. Well, I ain't going back to looking at you. I'm always looking at you. Oh, yeah? Well, that don't support what do you need. I was told you're the per- Ooh, yeah. Whoever you've been talking- Are we talking people? What you looking to a boo- A person. Am ah, yes. I can't get to- These trigger happy- My go-to for the- Library and heart- Anyway. Explosion store? Do me a favor, you Cut through the reclaimed. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Doing okay. Hey, tourists, check it out. We got orders flying in. Yeah, thanks, man. Do you mind dealing with them? You're a great shot. You're up.
thing. Invisible. Bomb, bomb, bomb. Great, so they all have bombs. Oh, you have bullshit. Exposed chests. None of them are setting off the bombs. Great. Well, guess I have to shoot them.
I was too close. <sighs> I wish I could save mid 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 missions, although that would make it too easy. Also, their explosion radius is fucking huge. I was doing—I thought I was doing very well as well. Also, just to let people know, sprinting attracts them, as if you didn't notice, as well as clear cancels out this effect. So, hey, you on the prowl? I see you looking with some rabbit dog eyes. Well, I ain't going by. You looking to deal? I'm always looking to. Oh yeah? Well, that don't surprise me. What do you need? I was told you're the person to see if I. Oh yeah. Whoever you've been talking to, are we talking people? What you looking to oblivion? person in person ah yes i feel you i can't get to him right now there's some interference these trigger happy reclaimed types got me cut off from my boy my go-to for the heavy ordinance library in hardeman hall anyway explosion store is open do me a favor and remind you cut through the reclaimed yeah 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 consider Right. Let's go, shall we? Doing all right for health. Hey, 
Hey, tourist, check it out. We got orders flying in. Thank you. Nothing better to do? You can chant. Hi, buddy. Ugh. <sighs> 
I hear chicken. I'm ready to listen. Looks like you got yourself in a tough situation, buddy. Maybe I'll cut some wires. What's the worst that could happen? Yet. Something moving. Oh, there you are. Oh, no knife.
Bye. You find Max? Get what you need? Not exactly. Wouldn't have anything to do with that blast I heard a few minutes ago. I tried to save him. That breaks my heart. He was a bud. Someone I could talk to. What happened? I think it was Garrick. Left behind a revenge note. I guess that's his thing. Man, that dude is a menace. And he had it out for Max, huh? I can't believe he's dead. That's so fucked up. Look, I'm sorry you didn't get what you needed. Check this out, though. I've been working on something for my own self-protection. A DIY grenade launcher type thing. I can't guarantee it's gonna tear through heavy armor, but it's the most lethal thing I've got. Here. You're gonna need some ammo for that. Check with your trade network buds out near Memorial Lane. I heard they scored a couple crates of grenades on a scavenge run. That's some leprechaun shit right there. I love grenades. No one loves them more than me, but they're not easy to come by. I found Zerker Lord. First edition. First edition, poor guy? Holy shit. Which one? Can I see it? Yep, this is it. Thorgath, hmm. Zerker, Lord. Maybe you Max got me hooked on this series back when we first met. This was his favorite volume, which is why he held out on me for so long. You won't believe the dreams I've had being this dude, Thorgath. Except I'm rocking this massive pair of shit-kicking boots, and that's all I do. I go around stomping the shit out of anything that gets in my way. Mm. Did you ever get in this no. I'm not really a reader. Hey, it ain't for everybody. But it's basically saved my sanity. 800 pages of pure zen. You know what I mean? I've got an old Forgath Volume 1, first edition. Feast of Beasts. Fucking classic. Used to be worth a bunch of money. Now it's pure sentimental value. Which to me, makes it priceless. Give it a read, and maybe one day you can let me know what you think. Book Club Buds. How did you and Maxwell connect? It's a fucked up story. You sure you want to hear it? I can handle it. Are you like sure sure? 100% positive? It's messed up. Yeah, I'm fucking positive. Tell the goddamn story. All right, but don't judge me. I hate being judged. So, about two weeks after I started rolling through the street solo, before I had this new reality all figured out, my brain was on the brink. No food for almost two weeks. I was seeing things swooping down on me from the sky like these bird phantoms with fangs and glowing eyeballs. Oof, terrifying. Thinking I'm finished, right? But then I stumble onto this fresh corpse, lying there naked. So I get out my knife. Maybe I can just carve off a little piece of that corpse. Crisp it up on a fire like a brisket. No one's around, no one's going to know. So after some deep contemplation, I say screw it. I dive right in, jab my knife into some ass meat, and the corpse jumps up, screaming and flailing. The corpse wasn't a corpse, it was Max. Oh, I apologized profusely. Then we just hit it off, talked for hours about our lives before all this. He was a good listener. You're right. 
didn't need that image. I knew I should have kept my trap shut. Have you heard of Garrick? Heard of him? I've seen him. In action. Was up on a rooftop having a smoke, and I saw these tower scrubs running in the street, panicked. I couldn't really see what had them freaking out, but then this axe comes whipping through the air, and whap, takes one of them down. Axe lodged right in the spine. She's down there, twitching and screaming. The rest just kept on running. Then, this huge dude, size of a grizzly bear, steps out of the shadows and grabs the axe handle, and he starts dragging this lady behind him with the axe still in her, like she was some slab of meat. That was it for me. I couldn't get away from there fast enough. I've seen tons of horrible shit, but nothing like that, ever. Wait a second. Are you planning on messing with that dude? He needs to be dealt with. You're crazier than I thought. That shit crazy. Done chatting. I've got other shit to do. For sure. Send my best to Desiree if you see her. I got one free slot, but I don't care. Let's, let's drop all this stuff off. Put it down here.
Look, another bit of elephant. Seems good to me. I just need two things. Can you back up one of those? And one sterile bandage. Full stock time. I need, oh yeah. It was like upgrade over here that I wanted, wasn't it? More shafts. Always low on shafts. Right, before I end the episode, I'm going to check to see the these. And I'm going to drop off. Check in with the Tourist. Damn, it's good to see you. Got your bolt cutters. What about the flyers? What did, what did the exiles say? Good news. I talked to Patricia. She was doubtful at first, but she started putting the flyers out and it got people talking. She says they're ready to take the fight to the tower. This is great news. Sounds like we got our army. Time to unleash it on Mama. The Exiles have a request. Ammo's in short supply. They got weapons, I guess. And people who know how to use them. But if you want them to fight with you, they're gonna need bullets. Serendipity, tourist. Enter the star of our show, Billy Bolt Cutters. We can start stealing what we need from the tower. Sneak it out to the Exiles. Echo, you can help us with that. For sure. As long as they'll actually talk to me. They will. I told Patricia you were with us. That won't be a problem anymore. Thanks, tourist. We'll contact you when the time is right. Won't be long now. Mama's end is near. Sweet. Right, I guess that's it for now. I'm going to head back to base. So all uh, normals out of the way. We have that one optional side quest that we can deal with, I suppose. But you don't get—I don't get much in returns. It's not really that good.
Well, I think that'll do. If you enjoyed, leave a like, subscribe, and have a good one.